I did Southpaw because my own anger and you know my own issues with that are things that I wanted to explore. Really? Yeah, that was a world I wanted to go into. I wanted to look it in the face and I wanted to say like, what is this in a space that's safe? So what did you learn about yourself through examining anger in the film that, that you'll take with you outside of the character and the film experience? One of the things I think about about the movie is that it's all about vulnerability, right? Like, the more you're able to be vulnerable to whatever it is in the world, you know, we put all these things up. You know, we, you have to, you know. Every one of us has a different thing and a million different things that we use and whatever. And to be an adult, that sense of vulnerability, see who you really are, I think that's what we want, you know, is like, I, I would hope we all want to be able to be open with each other. Yeah. But I speak for myself, I can't be in that way that I want to be. And so what I learned from Southpaw is anger without rage can be a very healthy thing. I'm not saying like you should live a life without anger, but like rage, which is inexplicable and can lead to crazy things, which it does to the character, is there's really not any, there's really not a place for it. There's that scene in the movie, and I don't want to give anything away, but where, you know, his daughter hits him. Yes. To see a fighter who's like vicious and gets off eventually by getting hit and hit and hit and harder and harder and only really gets off when his, there's blood in his mouth and needs somebody to fucking take him and drive him to that place. The thing that kills him more than anything is like being hit by his daughter and he could never touch her. Do you know what I mean? And, and he sits there in that moment. And I remember with me and Antoine, like I was t we were talking through the scene and like I said to Una, I was like, you can hit me. Now, it wasn't written. And I like, you can hit me. And she just didn't want to at all, you know? And, and, and I was like, you can, you can say, say the lines to me and hit me when you say it. And she did, she's an amazing actor. She's just an amazing actor. And, oh, and, and, it, and you just think about the power that that connection has over this guy who could get hit a million times by a grown man the same size as him. But that happens with his daughter and it's just like, he's wrecked. I was very proud of that moment in it as an expression in the movie, you know, very proud of that thing. It's just because you like, you never know where you're going. You know, you never know what's gonna take you. You never know where you're headed, you know? You just know like, you know, this is something I wanna explore and this looks like a good way in. But I didn't know, like, I didn't really know what I was getting into.